How do you feel about Wink Martindale leaving the Giants? Okay, so... Because <laughs> that's a complicated like situation. It feels like a power struggle there. Uh, you know, those rumors of him just not getting along with Dable. Mm-hmm. Oh, there might have been some credibility to that now that Wink Martindale kind of steps aside. You know, if... if um, but but I thought like they were only fighting over the last pizza pizza in like the uh, the, the the coach's office. I thought that's what they were fighting. About. I on. feel like if Martindale was really wanted, that he wouldn't have resigned. You know, like like Dable would have been like, "Hey, dude, I need you to come back," and Martindale would have been like, "Hey, I'm coming back." I don't know. Maybe Dable would was secretly yelling at him like, "Dude, you don't have to blitz like all the time," you know. But. Oh. Uh, tables the coach now that i think about it, it they did actually fire a lot of his assistants which forced the mm-hmm. resignation because they couldn't actually fire martindale so i think yeah. there was a power play maneuver happening there that's why i figured i'd get your uh, like ask your opinion on that because as i said it's a it's a very murky situation yeah but bobby johnson needed to go well uh no he was the o-line coach yeah um, they, they, they got rid of yeah a lot of parts but the thing was is like yeah if, you, if you're going to say which unit was the best on the Giants this year, definitely the defense was. Mm-hmm. Like, Okereke became a stud. Fucking De- McFadden, Micah McFadden is now, like, one of those white guy rece- uh, linebackers in the middle of the field that you that we've always wanted. He's like a Luke Keekley. I mean, he's not as good as Keekley, but, oh, he's like, he's Keekley. that. Come on. Yeah, but every every team to be successful needs a white dude in the middle for some reason, you know, like a Brian Cushing type. And they've got that guy in McFadden. Now and and you got to give credit to Wink Martindale for developing these players, getting rid of you know guys that like Shimenez that that you thought would be good that thought would turn into a Karake, and playing really good defense with a patchwork secondary. Like the secondary was kind of ass outside of McKinney, you know. Like they they weren't that good this year, and and they masked it by just blitzing the hell and doing a lot of stunts and Mike fires and and it was a lot of scheming. But this does open the door. For Antonio Pierce to come back to the Giants. If if the Raiders, Raiders don't keep him, though. I don't know. That's There's no way the Raiders keep him. You There's never know. No I mean, way. here's the That's thing with the Raiders, though. He's Davis actually he's building an identity with the team, though. I mean, nope. the, the tactics can be questions, but like with Antonio Pierce, they feel more like the Raiders than the Raiders have in a very long time. 